Ukrainian troops trained by the West stumble in battle. The initial phase of Ukraine's counteroffensive against Russia has met with significant challenges, with troops trained and armed by the United States and its allies struggling against Russian minefields and artillery fire. Despite being equipped with advanced American weapons, some units have been lost or performed poorly, prompting a change in tactics. Ukrainian military commanders are now focusing on wearing down Russian forces using artillery and long-range missiles, rather than attempting to break through minefields under fire. A troop surge is taking place in the south of Ukraine, with a second wave of Western-trained forces, launching mostly small-scale attacks. However, the results have been mixed, with Ukrainian troops managing to retake only a few villages so far, and failing to achieve the kind of sweeping gains seen in the cities of Kyrgyzstan and Kharkiv last fall. The change in tactics has raised questions about the quality of the training received from the West and the effectiveness of the tens of billions of dollars worth of weapons provided, including nearly $44 billion from the Biden administration. It is unclear whether this investment has successfully transformed the Ukrainian military into a North Atlantic Treaty Organization standard fighting force. Despite these setbacks, Experts believe that the counteroffensive will continue for several months and that the problems lie more in the initial assumptions about what could be achieved with a few months of training. Thanks for staying tuned till the end of this update on Ukraine's military situation. If you found this video informative, hit that like button and subscribe to our channel to stay updated with more news summaries. Your support helps us deliver comprehensive news content regularly. Remember, your likes and subscriptions can make a huge difference. Until next time, stay informed, stay vigilant.